Welcome to AyurvedicScience.com. This is Dr. Vinder Suri. Billion dollars worth of statin drugs are sold every year. Are they really safe? More than 18 million American population is using statin drugs on a daily basis. 21 billion dollar worth of statin drugs are sold in 2000 year alone. Pfizer sold nine billion dollars worth of statin drugs in that year. When there is a that much money involved, are you going to see the real research coming out of it? That is the question the scientific community is asking. They are doubting the true value behind the plethora of research published on statin drugs. There is a recent article published in the issue of JAMA January 2010 where Dr. Mike Mitka questions the beneficial effect of statin drugs in heart disease. He agrees that it lowers LDL cholesterol, which is true, but does it have any, any beneficial effect? So the questions are, do we really decrease the mortality of heart disease with statin drugs? Are they safe on a long-term basis? Are they safe for the use in kids? Uh, is there side effects, long-term side effects? Because there is only less than 17 years of use of statin drugs. So we don't have long-term study available of the statin drugs yet. The study where Dr. Mitka compared two uh, different studies in that uh, commentary and he showed that people who were on statin drug did not have effect on the carotid uh, thickness neither when the zetia was added had any effect but when the niacin was added the uh, carotid thickness decreased which is a very positive effect so that means niacin has a positive role on the carotid thickness and, and prevention of heart disease. The list of side effects is long. Muscle spasm and cramp is a very common side effect. Lots of people comes to my clinic, Dr. Sori, when I started this uh, uh, statin drug, I have having worst leg pain ever. My sex drive went off the door. And on the serious side of this side effect, it can lead to rhabdomyolysis, which is kind of a fatal kind of disease which actually end up having a kidney failure. Some people can have ruptured tendon because uh, uh, especially if you're young exercising diabetic people it has a uh, liver uh, inflammation as a side effect. Uh, has a gastrointestinal issues. Low libido, we talked about that already. Uh, ALS kind of disease has been linked to uh, use of statin drug. Interestingly Statin drugs has been prescribed for many neurological diseases on the theoretical basis. But does it really help? But the research shows otherwise. Um, the research which has been published showed that it decreases cognitive function. Also, statin drugs lower your hormone production because it interferes with the manufacturing of cholesterol and cholesterol is the building block of your all hormones, especially your testosterone, estrogen, progesterone, DHEA. Also, it lowers the manufacturing of vitamin D. Also, fat soluble vitamin like vitamin A, D, E, K. Cholesterol is normal manufacturing in the body. We get cholesterol from our diet and also body manufactures it. Cholesterol is our survival because in older days when we did not get food, body stored food as cholesterol and in the uh, time of starvation we were using that cholesterol. But that's not happening these days. We are getting long and steady um, chain of food and uh, actually we end up eating extra. So there is the caloric intake issues with the cholesterol here. 50% of people who has a heart disease does not have issues with cholesterol at all. They may have issues with the uh, C-reactive protein, cardiac. They may have elevated level of homocysteine. They may have uh, low levels of testosterone, uh, vitamin D, uh, low mineral levels, low B vitamins. Uh, the people who are diabetic, hypertensive, has a lot more chances of dying with heart disease. Dr. Dean Ornish, many years ago, uh, used Ayurvedic model of uh, uh, 
healing the cardiovascular diseases in which you use a nutrition, exercise, a yoga, stress management and show to reverse the heart disease. Since then he has duplicated that study many times. Ayurvedic herbs are phenomenal. I have been using these Ayurvedic herbs for more than 30 years and these are transformational. Uh, they just completely transform people. My favorite one is Google, Trifla, Arjuna. Uh, again, you know, you don't only want to depend on the, the statin drug or uh, the herb only. You have to put your part into it. You have to do exercise. You have to do your meditation. Uh, you have to eat right. If you're not eating right, you're not going to help. Again, if you look at the Mediterranean diet that has shown to reduce the risk of heart disease and not only heart disease but many other diseases because that's a healthy uh, style of eating food. Also fish oils has shown to reduce LDL cholesterol and also decrease the mortality with the, the heart disease. Again, our body is a temple and you need to worship it. This is Dr. Virindasuri.